In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to fix Strava incorrect distance quickly and efficiently. Sometimes after a great run or bike ride, you might notice that Strava hasn't quite captured the correct distance you travelled. Don't worry, it's a common issue, and I'm here to help you resolve it in no time at all. First things first, you need to open Strava on either your desktop or your phone's browser. This is an essential step as we'll be accessing specific options that might not always be available on the mobile app. Once you've logged in, navigate to the activity where you noticed the wrong distance. This could be your last morning run, or perhaps that long bike ride you did over the weekend. Trust me, we're going to get that mileage right. Next, look for the three dot menu or the edit button on this activity page. This button is typically located near the top right corner of the screen. What you're looking for might be a little different depending on whether you're using a desktop or mobile browser, but rest assured it's there. Take your time to locate it as it's the gateway to the adjustments we're about to make. Once you click on this menu, you'll see an option that says correct distance. Selecting this option allows Strava to work its magic. By choosing this feature, you're prompting Strava to go back and recalculate the entire session using the original GPS data recorded during your activity. It's essentially like giving Strava a second chance to crunch the numbers and get them right. After selecting correct distance, Strava will begin the recalculation process, pulling from the GPS data it initially collected. Let it process for a moment. This is where Strava takes all that valuable satellite data and works out the correct distance you've covered. Depending on your connection and the length of your activity, this might take a little time. Grab a sip of water while it does its thing. Finally, once Strava has recalculated the distance, you'll be presented with the updated figure. The last and perhaps the most satisfying step is saving this updated distance. Make sure to hit the save button so that the corrected distance replaces the incorrect one. Now, with everything saved, you can confidently reflect on your training gains. And there you have it, by following these simple yet effective steps, you've now corrected the distance on your Strava activity. I hope this guide was helpful for you and that your Strava records now reflect your true efforts and achievements. Keep these steps in mind whenever such issues arise, and you'll always have accurate data for your activities. Thank you for joining me today to get those figures right. Take care and happy training.